Shalom friends, it's Eli Dan from A Teacher Group and in today's question of the week we are going to learn how to write and pronounce the Hebrew letters Tet, Yod, Chaf and Lamed. Stay tuned till the end and I will share with you an amazing fact about the Hebrew language. How to write and pronounce the letters Tet, Yod, Chaf, and Lamet. כיצד לכתוב ולבטא את האותיות Tet, Yod, Chaf, Lamet. First of all, let me meet the letters. The letter is Tet, Yod, Chaf, and Lamet. Tet, Yod, Chaf, and Lamed. Let's learn how to write them. Tet. One, two, three, and four. One, two, three, and four. One more time. One, two, three, and four. The letter Yod. One and two. And one and two. One. And two. The letter Chaf, Chad, Shtaim, Shalosh. One, two, three. Chad, Shtaim, Shalosh. And if we're going to put Dagesh, this is the point in the middle, it would be pronounced as Kaf, as the letter K. And the letter Lamed. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, Two, three, four. Let's learn uh, words with those letters. First of all, with the letter Tet, Tabat, Tet, Bet, Ein, Taf. Tabat would be ring, Tabat. The word for good in Hebrew is Tov, Tet, Vav, Vet, Tov. And for lamb, the word is Tale, Tet, Lamed, He, Tale. In the letter Yod, we have the words Yeled, Yod, Lamed, and Dalet, with the E vowels, with the vowel Segol. Yeled, Sun. The word Yom is Day, Yod, Vav, Mem, Sofit. Yom. And the last word is Yad. Yad would be Hand. Yod with Kamatz, this is the long A vowel, and the letter Dalet, Yad. If we want to say all in Hebrew, we will say kol, kaf and lamed, kol. Heavy in Hebrew would be kaved, kaved, kaf, vet, dalet. As you can see, the letter kaf comes with the dagesh, the point in the middle of the letter, and this is kaf, kaf, as k. And uh, the last word is kise, kaf, samech, alef. Kise would be chair. And let's learn words with the letter Lamed. Lamed, uh, Lo would be no, Lamed Aleph. Lev would be heart, Lamed Vet. And the word Lamad would be he learned, Lamed Mem Dalet. Hebrew is the third common Semitic language in this world after Arabic and Amharic. Thank you for watching this video. See you next time. You are more than welcome to leave a comment.